Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As so you can see, my last video we had the S2000 on the dyno. We had numbers. We have 228 horsepower on the CRX. At the, I mean, on the, on the S2000 at the wheel. When the motor was cold, 227, 98. When the motor was hot, that means that when the motor is still cold or hot, it's gonna run the same numbers. Now, almost now. I'll take that back because Junior might be like, Freddy, what the hell are you saying? No. <laughs> 220, 227.98 when the motor was hot. That's pretty dang good for this car. The only thing I had done to this vehicle, as you all know, it was uh, one time I redid the head, shave it, put uh, ARP pistons on it. I mean, ARP uh, studs. I did the, um, what's it called? I did the head, shave it, put it back on. Rebuild the transmission, the uh, standalone system computer, uh, Viari, uh, scat back and sauce, and I'm having fun. Uh, I do have a motor mount that just broke, and I'm about to replace it uh, maybe next week. And today I'm working maybe on the hatch on the CRX. All right, guys, as you can see, we already started there. Film, that's the way it's supposed to go. It's gonna look good. You know what? I want one of these for the Integra. So now I might have this in an Integra. Look at that. So that was pretty, pretty cool, pretty awesome. So now I had to cut. It's kind of confusing because you brought me a template that's supposed to cut. Mark okay. where that's supposed to go. Oh, that's for here. Okay, so this is how it's supposed to go. I got to get a tape and template right there. And I guess I got to cut on top of it. Uh huh. And please do on the top side mount line. Okay, so that's the way it's supposed to sit. You get me some tapes and put this on. And, um, because I got this other template right here. This is the one that's confusing me the most. Not this one. This one. Because. Ah, uh, okay. On the fender. So. Um, Defender. I don't get at this one. I mean, I guess that one was for here. I don't know. I hope I don't screw with Defender because it says right there how this is supposed to go straight here. See? Put it right here. Right there. And boom. I don't know if I'm supposed to, I don't know if I'm supposed to cut. All right, let me let me do something. Me Alright guys, there you go. There you have it. There's the hatch. Right there. That was amazing, huh? So what I'm gonna do. On my tomorrow, I want to get that side, the other side. I'm going to cut it the right way, put it together, and the hatch will be done on this end of it. Huh? It looks good. It looks good. That's what you guys want it. That's what you guys get. It's real hot. Nice. You can paint this the same color of the hatch. I like the line him down i don't like this body line but it's plastic what are you gonna do about it it looks hot well guys let me see it for tomorrow we're gonna do the other side all right guys we're gonna start with the fender that's gonna be the fastest easy way to do it um we're gonna take with the allen key these out 10 minutes so
And the subject of this, since I got brand new ones, I keep these and I hold them. You know, I got purple ones, uh, these. So I put these to the side. I ordered those from um, Amazon just to give you that look, that JDM look. But you, how you know, Password JDM is out of business. So I ordered these for that. Loose. So I gotta loosen. I wanna keep that the gap right there on the vehicle. Oh my lord, look at that mess. Um I have a wash uh, I think it's over there. I gotta put another one of these on. Um, but talking about this, I need to take I need to take these out. You can see somebody took that out. They almost broke the clip, so I gotta take this out very gently. Out, so I can get into that part right there. And uh, I can see somebody already put an aftermarket one there. So I'm trying to fix this real quick. Take this out. So I can get to that fender. Let me get that. Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. Look what I found. Man, not even a, a black tape or nothing. What the fuck, bro? Oh, Lord. For the record, I did not do this. Holy shit. I cut the hash right there. I'm gonna put everything here. Man, it's a miracle that my headlights are working. Holy shit. So, you know what that's gonna happen, right? I'm gonna have to rewrap this and make sure everything it's wrapped better than what what it is. Holy shit! Oh man. Anyway, look, somebody broke a bolt down there, and this is why. Let me see if I can camera can catch it. See it right there? That's why it's coming apart. Cause I put this on and then it it the right way. Ah, let's go. guys so this is the problem we have you see this right here somebody got into an accident you can see right here they did that because the fender couldn't line up this is why see the hinges this is where the hit was boom they hit it right there and that's why i'm having a problem putting this on it's supposed to go the other one went perfectly in this was supposed to go right here and screw right there but I'm gonna have to work some magic. Cut what's supposed to be is not happening. <clears throat> it's supposed to be like that and then line up. So let me see what I can do. Again, <clears throat> it's a bolt right there. That's, I wanna tighten that bolt first. I'm gonna use this right here. Probably the owner of this hash doesn't know about the accident. This is when you guys buy a Honda that says, wow, it's clean. Uh-huh. Clean. Clean my butt. So it's supposed to be right there. See the gap? It's supposed to be right there. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take that down. I'm going to figure how to do I'm gonna have to do drill a, a um, right here the one right there just to keep this thing in place with a cap the gap perfectly like that so Is 
see, I was wondering what. That done there. Can do two things. Oh, right here. That one's hanging like that. Like this. But I can do it right here. Put that in there. Yeah, I guess on tap, tapper, whatever you call it, those the screws are tap in. I was wondering why this is not lining up is because the the car got into an accident. Yeah, this one's not even gonna go through there. I can put one here. I got these little guys right there on the floor. And I'm gonna try to put them one here, so hold right there and see what happens. Well guys, there you have it. <laughs> I guess I'm done for the day on this project. There she is. She is done. It looks amazing from the outside. I put the new screws that I told you about that I was gonna put. Um, I got new hinges coming up. I'm gonna take this off tomorrow, if today or tomorrow, but I'll take it off. I got new hinges. I'm still gonna put that back together. That and that back together so she can give the complete look. So she can look just like this on this side. More like a racer, right? Um, you see how this gap right here is too short? I'm trying to fix that over there. Because this one came out perfect right here. I just gotta move this. I gotta loosen it up and move it forward. Line up this, line up this one right here, and screw that one off because somebody messed it up now i gotta drill that out and put a rivet in there so i can bolt down the, the, the fender so you gotta do that right there but i'm done with this side i'm gonna put that all back together right now and that should look good on that side we have two new stickers there's one right there that's where you use all the parts that we did that today it's right there you can hit them up if you like that idea And I'm about to do this right now. Let me put you right down here first.
Okay, there you go. You look beautiful. Now, Say boom, chaka laka laka boom. But yeah, there we go. Later on, when we get to the body shop, I'm gonna fix the line. That, that door is dent right there too, so that's part of it. So that door's gotta get fixed. Well, then it looks dang good now. Looks like a damn drive car right now. What? So that's done. Let's see what else we can get ourselves in trouble, right? <laughs> 